Hello everyone, welcome to my new video, uh, 16 things I bought from Aliexpress for under $2. There's something to bear in mind, uh, I bought a lot of these while they was in the flash sales, so they might not be under $2 at the time you're watching this. Um, but yeah, they was all under $2 when I bought them. So uh, I'll start with... This, this is a car decal, which I thought was pretty cool. Um, I was expecting it to be a lot bigger than this actually, but I'm one of those people that I don't check measurements, I see something I like and I buy it. And most of the time when it turns up it's smaller than I expected. I never learn. Um, but yeah, that's the first thing. Um, also, six of these things are are the same thing essentially um, so I'll go with them next it's about Simpson pin or brooch whatever you want to call it We have a Mario. Now these are different to the ones we have in the UK, where they have this rubber or plastic back rather than a metal one. And they have some sort of black coating on them, which I would imagine would protect them from rusting. Next, you'll notice by the way that these pins have gone for um, you know all the classics. This is uh, from the film It. I'm sure you knew that. This one's a bit different. It has um, the metal, the metal clasp. Next, I'll try and speed up a bit, sometimes I go a bit slow. Um, this one is from Beetlejuice. I'm sure you recognise that. Next, already a classic, and I believe season 3 started last night. The Stranger Things pin. Very happy with that one. Oh, it's actually got two two pins on the back. Oh, very happy with that one. And last but not least, another classic. Ghostbusters. Now I have a little sash um, that I bought when my little boy was born, four months ago. Um, I'm gonna put these on it. And I'm gonna fill it with pins. So yeah, kind of cool. Um, so that's that's all the pins. Next we have a frozen watch. There's no real reason for buying all these things that I bought, apart from the pins. Um, there was on two dollars, and I thought they were worth it, so I got them. I mean, I'll give this to my daughter as well. You get some free stickers with it. That's that. Next is this puzzle. Now this one's wrapped in cellophane, but I noticed. That's it, um, it's broke. So this can happen from time to time with AliExpress because the seller sent this in um, a bag and it wasn't it wasn't padded. And so obviously you know damage is gonna happen. So yeah, a little bit disappointed with that. Um, you know, still have fun with it. 
I like things like that. Next is this, which is, I believe, stainless steel. A stainless steel glove pendant thing. It's solid, that chain is very solid, so yeah. That looks like that. I reckon my my, um, my oldest son would probably wear that. And I don't mind stainless steel jewellery. So yeah. Next is... I forget what these are called exactly, but the magnets are the the magnets and apparently the uh, I don't know why the um, I mean maybe you can educate me on this, but I don't know why they call they call them rare when um, there's so many of them for sale and you see these everywhere, not just AliExpress but in the local markets. So I'm not quite sure why they they call them rare. Maybe you know why. Leave a comment below if you do. Um, so yeah. I mean they're good fun. Could probably play with these for hours actually. De stress after a long day. So yeah, that's done. Next is this glove. Which I believe goes on your thumb. And your forefinger, your strap, put the strap around your wrist, and there's an on off button here. Press that on off button. And quite bright. So, that'll come in handy for, you know. Um, dark spots when you're doing plumbing or you know whatever repairs so yeah there's that next we have this which is a it's a pen um, that you balance on your fingers or something spin on your fingers some graphics there, some graphic illustration. Let's have a look. Okay, so these you push in the back there. Yeah, I think I'll leave that to my son um, to play with. I mean, it's a pen. You can use it as a pen. No, that side is. No, it's just. No, it's not. It's not a pen. At that. It's just a pen at one end. Okay, so yeah. Super fun, if you know what you're doing with it. And next is this. Now you may have seen one of these before, you may not. I've had one of these uh, in the past, the plastic one. And uh, I was a bit worried that this one wouldn't be um, very good quality. And um, not be as effective as the one I had, but it is, it really is. It's basically a box with a secret compartment that you can take out. Um, but you've got to work it out, and um, I got me a daughter to have a go. I give her sixty seconds to get it open, and then um, you can see that now. 
Alright, so this is Faye. And Faye's gonna try and get into this box in under a minute. Yeah? So I'll give you that. I'll set the timer. Stupid phone. And you have to try and get in that box. Have a look at it, have a feel around it, see if we can figure it out. It doesn't need forcing, it, it opens quite gently, so you don't really have to force anything, you just have to um, figure out how. Ten seconds left. Can I figure it out? Oh well. Right, so if you don't want to know how this is um, opened, if you want to get one yourself and you want it to remain a mystery until you get it to your your house, I would look away right now and I'll do it silently so look away right now right you can look again so yeah super fun I love these things nobody's ever opened it within 60 seconds Well, that concludes this video. Thanks for watching. Um, I'll probably try and make the video a bit shorter next time. I think it's been a bit long this one. Um, links are in the description. Please subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video.